Hi, I'm Ashley Heron. Welcome to the Lawton Fort Sill community of Oklahoma. We have about 14 core members and they represent the three public high schools we have here in Lawton. They're all united in their desire to expose the tobacco industry and really to prevent youth usage of tobacco. This year we really kicked off our tobacco-free recreation area efforts by hosting a legislative breakfast. What we wanted is our parks to be tobacco-free and have a healthier environment for our kids to play in. With the parks, we're trying to make it smoke-free and also clean so the children can come out and enjoy themselves. Our city council members then invited the youth to speak and we gave that brief presentation about the dangers of secondhand smoke and the need for a local ordinance to make our community um, recreation areas tobacco free. I really do think that the tobacco company markets towards kids. I really would like to stop that with our SWAT team and I think we have the power to. The shoe piece behind me represents the 375 Oklahomans that died in six months alone from secondhand smoke. People walk up to the exhibit, they see these shoes, they're like, what are all those shoes? And it's 375 lives that are lost right there. And that's made a huge impact, I think, on our community. To win this award was an incredible experience for them. So many of them just didn't identify themselves as somebody who would represent us nationally. And I think this has really empowered them to see the potential that they have to make an impact beyond this community. We feel like with all this recognition that we're getting, it will really raise awareness in our community about what SWAT is. It's one of the best feelings in the world to know that you're recognized for the hard work that you've done. There's um, no chance that Big Tobacco is going to pull anything over on this community.